Hey everyone, I'm Connie, a writer at JetPens. It's been almost five years since I graduated college, and in that amount of time, tons of new stationery have been released. That got me thinking, what school supplies would the JetPens team buy if they were still in school? In this video, three of us will show you the pens, notebooks, and other accessories that we would use if we still had to go to class, as long as we don't have to do any homework. I'll start us off. I actually got a lot of my school supplies from JetPens when I was in school, so most of my picks are things I genuinely used. I really liked these Kokuyo campus notebooks when I was in high school. It was so convenient that the pack had five notebooks in it, because I could use one for each class. I could also tell them apart easily, because the covers are different colors. These notebooks use Kokuyo's iconic dotted rule, which made it super easy to format bullet points or draw graphs. I didn't have to find a specific notebook for calculus. I could just use a campus notebook from my stash. I like how there are lots of charming cover colors now. If I had them, I think my classes would have been a little more fun. Writing down homework and due dates in a planner is the best way to make sure you stay on top of all your classwork. I used to make my own planner when I was in high school and college, and it looked a lot like the Mark's undated weekly log diary. This planner has space for each day of the week on the same spread. I find this really useful for looking ahead and making sure you're not forgetting what's due at the end of the week. The calendars in the front let you plan further in the future, like if you have an essay due at the end of the semester. Because this planner is undated, you can start it whenever you want. That's especially handy when the first day of school is in the middle of the year. The Uni Alpha Gel Shaka Shaker is actually such a throwback for me. It's what got me into stationery in the first place. Its ergonomic body and squishy grip section helps keep your hand from cramping during long writing sessions. Uni released the Alpha Gel Switch a few years ago, and it's such a cool upgrade to the standard Shaka Shaker. It uses the Kudu Toga's lead rotation mechanism, which makes sure the lead wears down evenly. You can turn off the mechanism in case you want a more stable writing experience too. I graduated with an English degree, so as you can imagine, I did a lot of writing. I didn't have a special eraser back then, but if I could pick one to send to past me, it would definitely be the Sakura Foam. This is hands down my favorite eraser. I love how cleanly it erases graphite. I prefer the Arch Foam since it has a special sleeve that helps keep it from breaking, but it's basically the same eraser as the standard Sakura Foam. Hi, my name is Anne, and I'm a videographer here at JetPens. American school supplies are terrible, and I can say this because that's what I used up until graduation. Stationery can be very thoughtful and versatile, so if you can, treat yourself. You know, within reason, of course. Don't be like me. <laughs> I tried using one spiral notebook for most of my classes because I, I, I didn't want to carry a lot of stuff in my backpack. My notes were a mess. If I could go back in time and give myself a list of better stationery to get, the Kokio Campus Smart Ring Binder Notebook would be the very first thing I buy. The covers fold back, which is a key feature to have when you're using tiny desks in lecture halls. It's also light, slim, and best of all, refillable. I don't have to limit myself to lime binder paper either. Not only are there some interesting sheet styles, there's different paper sizes too. I am a notorious margin doodler, so designating these mini Maruman loose leaf refills to art probably would have kept my notes cleaner. To top it off, I would definitely get some dividers to separate the notebook by subject. It's, it's amazing how much you can customize your notebook to fit your needs these days. Multi-pens were never on my radar in school, so here you go past me, I have a uni jet stream 3. I like that the rubber grip matches the rest of the barrel. It makes the design look very clean. This multi-pen features a large top button for black ink and smaller slide buttons for the blue and red refills. Since black ink is used the most, the refill on this multi-pen has 70% more ink than a standard Jetstream multi-pen refill. A lot of consideration went into this pen, and it's a vast improvement to the Bika used in college. I know what I said earlier about not wanting to lug around a lot of stuff, but drawing supplies are different. I would gladly carry all of my markers and fine liners just on the off chance that I would need them. The Sunstar Lumiere swipe pouch was made for past me. 
There are two movable dividers in the main compartment, so I can keep whatever I brought with me organized how I want. The top half slides down, making it easier to see what's inside. I think I would just leave it open in my backpack when class starts. That way, there's less stuff on my desk and it'd be easier to zip up and go. Hi everyone, uh, I'm Martin and I am a warehouse associate at JetPens. And one thing I can explain about my items today is that they just make sense. Back in school, I only used mechanical pencils because I would make tons of spelling mistakes. Having a pencil with a large eraser would have helped with that. That's why I chose the Kokio Fit Curve Mechanical Pencil. It's extremely affordable, so I can buy more if I lose them and not feel too bad about it. Plus, the pencil being larger helps my hand not cramp up, unlike holding a small pencil. For my notebook, I picked the Maroman Sev Couleur. It comes in multiple colors for different subjects or classes. The clear hardcover helps the notebook be much more durable. And the pages are perforated, so it makes it easy to take out pages to share notes. Back in school, I always carried a folder in my backpack for loose papers or scantrons. I've had my fair share of paper folders, and they would only survive about a semester. A plastic folder, like the Kokio Campus Clip folder, would have lasted me throughout all my schooling. This folder comes with a clip, making it easy to put in study guides or cheat sheets. For my last choice, I would get the Nomadics Wise Walker backpack. It's a great size, doesn't look too bulky or overly big. Classes now have a lot of online assignments, so having a laptop is a must. This backpack provides a laptop pocket to keep your laptop safe. It's important to me that backpacks are durable because I toss my backpack around quite a bit. And this backpack is made out of durable material. Are you feeling nostalgic for your school days? Let us know in the comments about the stationery you wish you had when you were in class. You can shop all of these products and more at jetpens.com. Be sure to check the description for links. Thanks for watching. American school supplies are trash and I will never say otherwise. I can say this because that's what I used up until graduation. Let me start over. <laughs> Here you go, pass me. Have a uni Jetstream 3 color ballpoint multi-pen. Oh, that's really long. <laughs> okay, here you go, Josh. This is my this is my little secret. Here, here we go. We gotta slide down. Woo. I don't know if you can see it, but <laughs> a snack. You know, I feel like oh, it's crinkly, very loud. Hold on, hold on. Okay, I feel like this thing would be such such a easy easy like snack holder. Like, isn't that amazing? Grab grab pen. Put it right there. See, see, isn't that great? Grab. Isn't that great? Isn't that ah oh. <laughs>